I'm Donna Livingston, and I'm an interior designer. I've been doing it, I want to say, since I was born. Everything was always about design for me. It's something that just really becomes a part of you, a fabric of who you are. I love what I do because every day is different and creative. have an exact title. <laughs> Junior designer, design assistant. It's not been established. We're about ready to start on a new project called the Carlisle Residence. The building is brand new. Nobody's lived in it before. And we're gonna bring it from a concrete shell into my personal residential home. We're going to start and finish this project in less than three months. This is gonna have to get ramped up, maybe double padded. This is days and days of work and coordination and people and crews. I don't know who that guy is. My name is Nicholas Proietti. I've worked for Donna for close to six, seven years, perhaps. The bottom was supposed to be 20 inches, and then everything else was at eight. Then don't go to Japan and stay around so you know what's going on. Donna's a, an amazing person. She's a great designer. There's never a dull moment with Donna. I'm so anxious. Maybe I'll help, I'll help a little bit myself. Oh, how's that? I'm getting closer and closer to be able to sleep in this bed. This is going to be Donna's new television. Between your contractor and your designer, all of that requires a certain amount of coordination and organization. And even though I might be top 100 designer, according to Architectural Digest, I was on a shoestring budget. How much are these sofas? By making this here, we'll make this inexpensive closet look more expensive. I, I just want to get the maximum amount of shoes in. So now it's been three months from start to actually when I got to sleep in my own bed, sit on my sofa in my living room and really enjoy my environment. I don't think I want to change. I don't think I want to move. I really love where I am. This is just the beginning and we're gonna do it again and again and again.